direct form to realization direct form to So in direct form 1 we have seen the structure for IIR filter it requires m plus n memory units m plus n plus 1 multipliers m plus n adders here in this direct form 2 we reduce the memory locations number of memory locations hence it is called as canonic form canonic canonic form realization structure see here we have seen the equation in the direct form 1 structure that is y of n is equal to minus summation a k y of n minus k here k is 0 to k 1 to n k 1 to n plus summation k 0 to m b k x of n minus k so if you apply here z transform on both sides then then it becomes y of z is equal to minus a k summation z power minus k y of z sorry summation k1 to n a k z transform of y of n minus k is z power minus k y of z plus summation k0 to m b k z power minus k x of z so here y of z is nothing but so common here and then uh, take this term uh, here this side then take the y of z as common now 1 plus summation k 1 to n a k z power minus k that is equal to summation k 0 to m b k z power minus k into x of z x of z is independent to the summation k value y of z also now take the ratio y of z by x of z that is summation k 0 to m b k 
जेड पवर माइनस के डिवाइडेड बाय वन प्लस समेशन के वन टू एन ए के जेड पवर माइनस के इट इज सेट टू बी हेच ऑफ जेड ट्रांसफर फंक्शन ऑफ द पर्टिकुलर आई आई आर फिल्टर हेच ऑफ जेड सो दैट्स वे हियर फ्रॉम दिस सो ऑब्जर्व यू कैन गेट द जीरोस फ्रॉम दिस वी कैन गेट द पोल्स राइट सो ओके नाउ कंसिडर दिस इक्वेशन दट इज ईक्वल टू दट मीन्स एच ऑफ जेड इज ईक्वल टू वै ऑफ जेड बाई एक्स ऑफ जेड नाउ टेक वन डमी वेरिएबल दट इज डबल्यू ऑफ जेड हेन्स we can write like this y of z by w of z w of z by x of z w of z w of z gets cancelled then you can get y of z by x of z so hence here y of z by w of z into w of z by x of z is equal to summation k0 to m bk z power minus k by 1 plus summation k1 to n ak z power minus k so now let here uh, consider like this y of z by w of z is nothing but numerator polynomial that is nothing but k summation k 0 to m b k z power minus k w of z by x of z is nothing but 1 by 1 plus summation k 1 to n a k z power minus k so from this right y of z is equal to y of z is equal to w of z into summation b k z power minus k now expand w of z into b0 plus b1 z inverse plus and so on bm z power minus m that means b0 w of z plus b1 z power minus 1 w of z plus and so on bm z power minus m w of z this is the equation for y of z consider this one as equation a now take the another equation from this w of z is equal to w of z is equal to here x of z by this one then multiply here this one 1 plus summation k1 to n a k z power minus k is equal to x of z so now from this w of z into W of z uh, into one plus summation k one to n a k z power minus k is equal to x of z. So here W of z plus a one z power minus one W of z plus a two z power minus two W of z and so on. a n 
z power minus n w of z is equal to x of z and hence you can get w of z is equal to x of z minus a1 z inverse w of z minus a2 z power minus 2 w of z minus a n z power minus n w of z so consider this one as b equation so right from these two equations we can develop the direct form to realization structure like here so again I am writing here equations A and equation B equation A and equation B what is the equation A y of z is nothing but b naught w of z plus b1 z power minus 1 w of z plus and so on bm z power minus m w of z equation b is w of z is equal to x of z minus a1 z power minus 1 w of z minus a2 z power minus 2 w of z and so on minus a n z power minus n w of z so here first we develop the w of z or w of n by using this equation so here input is x of n so here use the adder so then here you can get the w of z or w of n so now use the delay here z power minus 1 then here z power minus 1 w of z multiply that one with the multiplier unit that is minus one, a1 then the resultant one is minus a1 z inverse w of z which is added to the x of z so right so in this way here we finished these two terms in this way up to a n z power minus n w of z so use the delays like z power minus 1 and so on like this up to z power up to get the z power minus n so use the n delay units here and then use the multipliers like a minus a2 and so on minus a n then add all these values by using adders ok so now in this way so you can realize the equation w of z equation Now, from this W of Z, so to, to realize this equation A, so here we have the W of Z. Now, see here, take B naught multiplier. Then, already we have here Z inverse W of Z. So, use this one here. And then, multiply this one with the B1. And then, add here all these terms so here multiplier b2 
then here you can get the y of z or y of n. See here y of z is nothing but v not w of z, v not w of z plus here v1 z inverse w of z plus v2 z power minus 2 w of z plus z power minus of m minus 1 w of z into b m minus 1 plus z power minus m w of z. Here if m is equal to n so uh, we just here if m is equal to n so we here uh, draw like this ok so equal number of uh, delay units are necessary to draw this one right but here if m is not equal to n one side other any side one side so use the more delay units and then complete this multipliers and summers ok here assumption is m is equal to n ok that's why here so the delay units so here n or m either n or m are sufficient to complete this structure see here this is the diagram complete diagram so in this way we can reduce the number of memory un memory units when compared with the direct form 1 ok this structure requires m plus n plus 1 multipliers of course same with the direct form 1 m plus n additions this one also same with the direct form 1 structure but here observe the delay units delay units are reduced here here maximum m comma n delay units are required right so that means if m is equal to n m number of delay units are necessary but in the direct form 1 it requires m plus n plus 1 memory units ok so here this is the advantage here and such that this is also called as canonic form. Thank you.